and welcome back to Hahu Bwari Padghar. I am Isha. I am Papuri. And together we are the Hoikya Hahu Bwari. Unfortunately, my dear mom-in-law and partner won't be joining us in this episode as she got COVID-19 few weeks ago. But now she is negative and recovering well. She'll be back soon with her recipes. Today I am making the famous Kashmiri Dam Alu. Also towards the end, we have a special segment today on nutritional health tips by Pushpanjali Well Health. This video has been compiled by 50 women and it is going to be really beneficial especially during this COVID times. Let's start by going over the ingredients for today's recipe. Some mustard oil, 650 grams baby potatoes, half teaspoon turmeric powder, one teaspoon ginger powder, one teaspoon fennel powder, three teaspoon Kashmiri mirch, half teaspoon cumin seeds, some cardamom seeds, a cinnamon stick, some cloves, a cup of yogurt, salt to taste, and cilantro for garnishing. We will start by frying the potatoes but before we fry them we will prick the potatoes with a fork so that the oil and masala gets absorbed well. Let me show you how it is done. So here you can see I'm just pricking them randomly. Flip it over and do the same thing. And we'll do this to the rest of the ones. We will fry the potatoes twice. First time we will fry it around 70% and we'll, let it, we'll keep it aside and let it cool down for a bit. And then we will fry it again until it's done before putting it into the gravy. We'll add the oil now. Since we'll be frying the Potatoes will need quite a bit of oil. Make sure the oil is really hot before you put in the potatoes. The oil is hot now so we'll add the potatoes. Just be careful before adding it, oil might splatter. The potatoes have been frying for a few minutes now. You can see that it is around 70% done. We will take it off from the heat and keep it aside so that it cools down a bit. Now we will add the fennel powder and half of the Kashmiri mirch powder to the yogurt. Mix them well. We are heating some oil for the gravy. Make sure you heat it on low flame. My oil is hot now so I'm going to add the whole spices. Again make sure heat is still on low flame. We'll add the turmeric powder and the rest of the Kashmiri mirch. So the idea is to not to burn the spices. But at the same time, it fries well. This looks good, so I'm going to add my yogurt mixture. Now we'll keep frying it until the oil separates from the yogurt. You can see it has already started looking beautiful. Oil and the yogurt has mixed properly. It looks beautiful. Here we'll add the salt, salt according to your taste. Now this is an optional step, you can add some sugar or not, it's up to you. I usually like to put some sugar, a little bit of sugar. Now while this mixture is cooking, I'm going to fry the potatoes here. Again, okay. oil is starting to separate here, so I'm just waiting for the potatoes to be done frying. And then we can put it in. The gravy looks amazing. So my 
Potatoes are almost ready. Now, here goes my potatoes. So now we're going to cook this until the potatoes are completely cooked. So now you can add water according to your requirements. I like less gravy, so I'm just putting a little bit of water. Let it simmer for some time. The potatoes have been simmering for a while now. Let's check it out. It's almost done. Let's just break one potato and find out if it is completely cooked. It's completely done and ready to be served. And it smells delicious. Can't wait to try it. The Kashmiri Dam Aloo is ready. Let's garnish it with some cilantro. There we go. Kashmiri Dam Aloo. The Kashmiri Dam Aloo is ready. Now it's time to taste it. You can serve Kashmiri Dam Aloo with roti or chapati or rice. I'm going to try it with roti today. Let's go ahead and try it. Result time. Hmm. Turned out yum. If you enjoyed this recipe, make sure to like the video and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We'll be back again soon with another recipe. Till then, bye! Now let's go over to our special segment by Pushpanjali Well Health.